Hey guys, this is Q, and so today what I have for you is an analysis of the Black Ops 3 Shadows of Evil Zombies trailer. Okay, so, uh, in this video I am going to be kind of just pointing out various things that I've noticed in the trailer watching it. It came out a couple days ago, and I've watched it like six times trying to get the best stuff. So, first off, this looks like it's a new pistol. And I'm not sure if it's the new starting pistol or if it's just a pistol off the wall, but it's shown uh, multiple times throughout the whole trailer. The next thing I noticed was a fan favorite function returning, the Pack-A-Punch. I mean, honestly, who doesn't love Pack-A-Punching their weapon? So the next thing I noticed was the new and improved shield. I mean, this is nothing like we've seen it in other games. I mean, this shield boosts and then blows up. I mean, that it's a, it's a subtle change. The next thing they showed in the trailer was this gumball machine and I honestly have no idea what it does. I feel like what it I feel like you pay and it gives you like powers like a drop would. Like I mean, this one made all the zombies go away and then the next one makes all the zombies kind of blow up. And I mean, I know that those aren't going to be perks, so I feel like they're still going to have the normal perk machines like Juggernaut, uh, Speed Cola, all the normal ones. The next thing they showed was something that we've seen similar stuff to, but nothing compares to this. I mean, what even is this thing? Like, three head tentacle thing? I mean, I feel like it's, it's, it's a slight difference from a normal zombie that just walks around and tries to eat your brains. So... Then the next thing they showed, the next creature, quote unquote, is a weird flying thing that reminds me of Extinction a lot, which I don't know if that's going to be good or bad. I mean, I honestly can't tell you just from this. So the next thing I saw in the trailer was something that I've been hoping that they'd add into zombies ever since I saw it in the uh, Origins trailer with Takio. And that is the sword. I'm so excited that they finally added a sword. I mean, I don't know if I like that you can throw it, which, I mean, it's kind of cool, but, I mean, I don't know. I wish it would have just stayed like a normal sword. So the last thing I noticed was right at the very end, they have this weird, like, Satanist table, and then this guy's up there, and then he kind of just explodes, and I mean, I honestly have absolutely no idea what this could be. I mean, I feel like it's something, like, you have to find somebody and then sacrifice them i mean i don't know if you guys have any ideas leave a comment but so thank you guys for watching and as always please like and subscribe thanks guys